From the moment they're born, parents are trying to keep their kids alive. I don't know what it is, but they go looking for danger. Am I right? Like we have to cover all the electrical sockets because they are drawn to them. And I don't know about yours, but mine always make a beeline for the stairs when I wasn't looking. And they tried to get through our baby gate and roll down like what? Now my kids are big and I still have to worry. It's hard to turn that off as they get older. And sometimes it actually gets worse. Like when I couldn't find them. Picture me driving around my neighborhood in a panic looking for my two boys. No way of communicating with them and no idea where they are. I was freaking out, thinking all the worst case scenarios as mothers do. And the only thing that calmed me down was stopping to pray. In my moment of parental panic, I knew that God knew where my kids were and that he loved them. So I asked him to take care of them because I couldn't. I asked him to be with them and protect them from harm and bring them back to me. I had no other choice but to trust God with my kids, even though it took a while to find them. God drew me in and gave me that peace as I searched. Parents, we have a grand responsibility, don't we, of caring for our kids, but also a big need to let them go and trust them to our Heavenly Father. A psalmist reminds us of that. Your eyes saw my unformed substance. In your book were written every one of them, the days that were formed for me, when as yet there was none of them. Fellow moms and dads, our God sees your kids when you can't. He sees them in their formation when you just felt their kicks. He sees their every day when you're still wondering if they'll be okay. When this parenting gig feels overwhelming and you worry about your precious little people, please remember that every one of their days is already accounted for by our God. So we can trust our kids to Him with full confidence. And when it's hard to do that, pray. Pray every worry to God and ask Him to help you surrender your kids to Him on those hard days.